Modern wind generators are very large rotating dynamic structures. These structures are based on land and at sea, and they are unmanned. In unusual situations, the forces from wind, ice, waves and operating strategy may excite its natural frequencies in an undesirable manner which can lead to dangerous situations. To avoid this situation, it is crucial to monitor the movements and vibrations of the tower, nacelle, rotor and blades, so operating conditions can be changed in time to damp or eliminate severe vibration and movements. The structural vibration monitoring sensor is an essential part of the wind generator safety system. We call it the SVM sensor. The SVM sensor is a highly robust and reliable sensor designed for harsh environments. Its mean time between failure is more than 700 years. It monitors up to four distinct natural frequencies, for example tower, nacelle, blades and rotor. It uses advanced digital signal processing to analyze the acceleration signals obtained from a two-axial inbuilt accelerometer capable to measure very low frequencies down to zero hertz. The SVM sensor can, for example, be located at the base frame and at the tail of the nacelle. It can be mounted with three screws or glued on and connected with the standard industrial M12 connector. A typical situation is tower sway tail wag introduced by rotor imbalance, blade edge vibrations, and blade flap vibrations. Let us look at what it measures. The SVM sensor measures the acceleration on both the X and Y axis simultaneously. The structural vibration frequencies will be dominated by the natural frequencies, not necessarily of the same amplitude on both axes. Focusing simultaneously on the rotating XY vector spanned out by the natural frequencies isolated by a narrowband filter forms what we call a motion pattern. The motion pattern can be depicted as an ellipse with major and minor axes and an orientation expressed by an angle. This ellipse may take any form in between a circle and a straight line depending on the movements of the sensor. The SVM sensor measure and calculate these three parameters, major axis, minor axis and orientation angle in real time. You can program the SVM sensor with up to four frequency guards, each monitoring a distinct natural frequency. Frequency guards are real-time measurements running at all times, comparing the measured levels to the alarm thresholds. If these are exceeded, an alarm is issued. The SVM sensor's narrowband filters are designed for fastest possible response time. You can in addition use the SVM sensor for troubleshooting and analysis of the vibration measured in general by using its toolbox of measurements as time signals, FFTs, enveloping, capstrom, tracking and RPM profiles and much more. You can program the frequency guards of the SVM sensor using the service program, setting natural frequencies, bandwidths, alarm thresholds and direction of deflection. Any alarm event is locked in a non-volatile lock, a crash lock, which can be uploaded by the service program. You can also program an analog output representing the level of one of the frequency guards, for example as a health good signal. How can you then connect the SVM sensor? It takes 12 to 24 volt DC power and is incorporated into an electric normally closed safety loop. It may be connected to a host or it can operate as standalone. You can monitor the health good output and you can daisy chain more sensors in the same safety loop and to the same host up to 32 SVM sensors. The host connection options are to a controller or computer through a serial RS-485 connection, to a LAN network using a converter or to a wireless network also using a converter or directly to the M system which is the TCM front end. 
The sensors are manufactured at a modern factory using surface mounted components and advanced assembly machines. After 62 hours of burn in at extended temperatures, sensors are tested and calibrated. All test results are registered and full traceability on each sensor is assured. Lastly, the SVM sensors are packed and ready for shipment. The sensors are developed by Grammar Newell's highly skilled engineers. This implies development of both hardware and software. You can contact our support engineer regarding use of the SVM sensors. Grammar Newell also provide remote WebEx training courses on the use of our products. Please contact our sales department for more information. Or go to our homepage www.gramnewl.dk where you will find more information as product data sheets and application notes. Thank you for attending this presentation.